Hey food enthusiasts, welcome back to another exciting episode where we explore the future of food. Today, we're diving into something truly revolutionary. Imagine this, what if tomorrow's meat didn't come from animals? What if it was grown in a lab, in a controlled environment, free from the ethical and environmental concerns of traditional meat production? Yep, you heard me right, lab-grown meat is not science fiction anymore, it's becoming a reality. Today I'm diving into the world of lab-grown meat, is it our culinary future or just a food nightmare? Let's rewind a bit and understand how we got here. From prehistoric hunters to modern agriculture meat has come a long way. Our ancestors hunted wild animals, then we moved to farming and raising livestock. Each step was a leap in food production, but now, it's taking a futuristic leap. We're talking about meat that's grown in labs using cutting-edge technology. Lab-grown meat, also known as cultured meat, is created by cultivating animal cells in a bioreactor. No slaughtering, just science. It's a process that could change everything we know about meat production. Picture this. Tiny cells taken from an animal are placed in a nutrient-rich environment. These cells are then nurtured and encouraged to grow. These cells multiply and grow, mimicking what happens inside a living animal. It's like creating a mini ecosystem where the cells thrive and develop. Eventually we get muscle tissue that looks, cooks, and tastes like real meat. Amazing, right? It's almost like magic, but it's all science. I had the chance to virtually tour a lab where this magic happens. It was like stepping into the future. Scientists in white coats, high-tech equipment, and rows of bioreactors growing meat. It's a fascinating blend of biology and technology. The future is now, folks. This technology could redefine how we think about food and sustainability. They explain how this process could revolutionize our food system. Imagine a world where meat production doesn't harm the environment or involve animal suffering. Now for the moment of truth, the taste test. This is where science meets the senses. I got my hands on some lab-grown steaks and meatballs. They looked just like the real thing. Cooked them up and wow, the aroma, the sizzle, it was all there. The taste and texture were spot on. It was hard to believe that this meat didn't come from a farm. Honestly, if you didn't know it was lab-grown, you'd think it's the real deal. It's that convincing. But it's not just about taste. There are bigger implications here. Lab-grown meat has a massive environmental advantage. It's a game-changer for sustainability. Check this out. It uses about 90% less water, reduces carbon emissions, and doesn't require vast amounts of land. It's a win for the planet. Feeding 10 billion people without destroying the planet? Sign me up, so... What's the catch? Why isn't everyone on board yet? Well, acceptance might be tricky. People are naturally skeptical of new technologies, especially when it comes to food. People are skeptical. It's not natural, it's expensive. And there are questions about long-term health effects. These are valid concerns that need addressing, but every revolution faces challenges, right? Think about the initial resistance to electricity, the internet, or even smartphones. Change is always met with hesitation. So, what do you think? Are you ready to embrace this change? Would you give lab-grown meat a try? Are you ready to try the meat of tomorrow? It's a bold step, but one that could lead to a more sustainable and ethical future. Drop your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more innovative culinary adventures. Your feedback is what drives us to explore these exciting topics. Catch you in the next video. Stay curious and keep exploring the future of food with us.